Particularly the Chevy uh, Silverado extended cabs 07 and 13s, and the sorry, I'm trying to read off my uh, box calculator over here. Um, and then the GMC 1500s, 2500s, 3500s, the extended cab versions of those. Um, these have all been molded on the bottoms to get the most space out of the undersea enclosures you can. I've done a few out of wood before, but you're so limited and you lack so much space when you build them out of wood. Um, the center hump is so high and there's there's a couple progressions of steps in the floors that by the time you actually make it out of wood and get the angles, you really almost have no space in there. And, and really, in my opinion, without the fiberglass mold, probably enough space for like two eighths sealed, maybe something similar to that. Um, more people have done other things, but I just, I couldn't find the space myself, so I didn't ever go any, for anything any bigger than that, so. This right here is the rendition of what I'm going to be offering for basically the extended cab trucks. Um, it's got a fiberglass mold on the bottom. You can change out any of the sub variations. Anything I offer on the website will work for these extended cab trucks with the seat lift. I'm only offering these boxes if you do a seat lift. Really without the seat lift, there's almost no usable space. It's, even for like this single 12 and a quarter box, there wasn't enough space in my opinion. Um, Maybe, maybe two eights would fit, but then also you run into issues of the way the humps are in the mold, I have to have a flange on the bottom of it and just the sub mounting baffle turns into a weird situation. So I'm only gonna be offering them with a seat lift option. I don't sell seat lifts yet. I'm probably gonna start soon, hopefully. Um, for now, you can get it from LMI, seat, LMI Welding, I believe it's called. Um, I'll post a link in the description below. Um, I'll show you guys where you can buy them, but also you can order these from my website. This one here is built for a CT Sounds Tropo XL10. Um, it's an afforded enclosure, 4 to 32 hertz. It's got an aeroport pointing out the front side. Um, the sub is going to be up firing from the seat. I have a two and a quarter recess. Um, that'll give the sub plenty of clearance, even with sub movement, cone movement, even at full excursion, I'll have plenty of room for that sub. Uh, most sub orientations are going to be forward facing baffle. I will have another video soon with a box that has an example of that. It's going to be for 6 eighths, so look out for that video as well. If you guys want to order something similar to this or any enclosures at all, let me know. I'll have links in the description below. Thank you.